Living statues. This is an illness where in 1917 it is estimated that more than half a million people across the world were afflicted with a frightening condition that put them in a statue-like state, speechless and unable to move, yet their minds still alive. It was first described by neurologist Constantin von Economo and pathologist Jean-René Cruchet. Encephalitis lethargica, also known as the sleeping sickness, began in Europe and rapidly spread around the world, reaching pandemic levels in North America, Europe, and India by 1919. The symptoms are characterized by a high fever, sore throat, a headache, lethargy, delayed physical and mental response, and a sleep pattern that is reversed from the normal. German neurologist Felix Stern examined hundreds of patients with encephalitis lethargica during the 1920s and said that the illness typically evolved over time with the early symptoms being dominated by sleepiness or wakefulness. A secondary symptom led to the upward motion of the eyes. The third symptom would be recovery, followed by a Parkinson-like syndrome. The cause of encephalitis lethargica is unknown and it quickly disappeared around 1927. For those that survived the illness, the majority developed neurological and psychiatric disorders years after they were diagnosed with the illness. Isolated cases of the illness continue to resurface, but fortunately not to pandemic levels. The scientists and doctors continue to research encephalitis lethargica and hope to prevent a future outbreak in the illness. Here is a retrospective review of possible historical outbreaks. Thanks for watching everybody. Until next time.